welcome back to another video and today we will be testing something out we we'll seeing which corn dog is better one that goes into the oven or one that will go into the microwave so which one do you think you will win and i want you guys to comment down below which one do you think is going to be better the corn dog is going to go into the microwave or the corn dog is going to go into the oven put your answers in the comments Give this video a big thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe. So anyways, we should get started. I have our pack right here. And um, oh, wait, wait. let me just get it out. Okay, so this is our instructions, our instruction guide. Okay. Microwave, okay. You probably can't see it, but anyways. So we're gonna place the corn dog in for 60 seconds in our microwave. So um, I'm gonna open my microwave first. We're just gonna take that out. Okay, so let's balance it. Perfect, got that in there. I'll make sure it won't pop or explode or anything. Close it in time cook. 60 seconds, so that's one minute. We started it. Okay, now let's preheat our oven to 375. So that's what we're gonna do. Bake, three, seven, five. Start, okay, so it's breaking and we have our corn dog cooking in there. And um, we're gonna have something else with our corn dogs. We're gonna have a peach. I know it might be like, oh, are you going to get full? Are you going to eat that peach? Oh, I'm going to eat that peach. So, yeah, and these are freshly picked peaches from my peach farm not too far away. Forgot what it's called. I forgot the owner's name. Mostly because I don't go there. Anyways, so yeah, since he sprayed stuff on it, we're going to have to watch the peach before we um 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 eat it. Yeah. So, anyways, yeah. And it looks like our corn dog's about to be done, so yeah. Here we go. Oh. Oh. Nice and hot. Hot. Hot, 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 hot. I'm gonna put that right there. Okay. It's a little greasy, I guess, but it's nice and hot and squishy. It's really good. And we're just gonna let this cool right now. Just gonna let it nice and cool. Get cool. Just gonna have to wait for that to finish preheating. So yeah. Um, yeah. But um this says to cook it for 20 minutes, but anyways we're gonna go put this back. Just because I'm gonna cook it for a little less. Because we know that the I know they always says Say, oh wait, wrong one. Oops. To go by the instructions, but if you have a good oven like ours, you, you can do a little twist to the instructions. See, I learned that from my mom. Like, oh, that's not good. Oh, whoa, <laughs> got messed up. But that's okay. That happens sometimes. Anyway, so like our oven is a really good one, so maybe we could do a little bit less. So I'm gonna do 18 minutes, yeah, 18 minutes for a corn dog. Anyways, um, I'm just gonna wait here. So, yeah. so it's been a while, and I've been just sitting here playing with my LOL sand. Yeah, I have LOL dolls. That's a pearl surprise where I keep all of that. And I've been just playing with my sand. So yeah, it's really satisfying. Okay, comment down below if this is satisfying or not. Oh, okay. Oh, no. oh crap, no. Mm. Uh -huh, chunk of it fell out, that's not good. Because my parents will not be happy if they see a messy floor and they'll look at me and be like, Serenity, and I'll be like, what? And they'll be like, why is our floor messy? I don't know, because the dog. So yeah, do you blame me for everything since I'm the only child? Yeah, if you're the only child, 
you get blamed for everything pretty much but like if you have a um, sibling too sometimes you will get blamed too because your sibling's cuter or like you're younger and you're the messier one you'll get blamed you'll get blamed for a lot of things but like if you're an only child that that's when like they know you did it okay so you can't blame your siblings for doing it can't get out of trouble they know you're the one who did it if you're the only child <laughs> So, yeah, they for sure know that you did it, and they have proof. Uh, there's no other child in this house, so. But if it's, like, your father's, like, a child, then be like, yeah, there's another child in this house, so it could like that. But, the fathers are responsible. Yeah, I mean, sometimes they're responsible, sometimes they're not. So, yeah, I'm just gonna keep on waiting. I'm so bored. Let's go check on the time. I'm just gonna pick this up. This is speckly. Wait, wait, wait. Oops. Oh, it's done! Yay! It's done, it's done, it's done. It's done. So I'm gonna have to set the phone down right now because it will be dangerous. So. Okay. <laughs> so I have this. Hello. What are you making? I'm making corn dog. I'm gonna see what's the difference between a corn dog that's from the microwave and from the oven. And the corn dog in the oven will be crispier. Still gonna see. Oh wait, oh dang it. I didn't put the corn dog in. Oh but it's still gonna be dangerous, so always be handy, handy. So we're gonna have to put this up here right now. Roll. Okay. Very careful because this corn dog likes to roll. So, I just started it, and I'm going to pause until, like, so you guys are going to miss me taking it out. But I'm going to kind of do a little review, because I want you guys to get the whole spam on which one's better, which one's... Okay, so this one's pretty much almost done. So, yeah, I'm just going to get some things ready, anyways, and, um, we'll see you later. Bye-bye. Hello, you're back again. We're back here again, and... Well, we have finished our corn dogs. This one is the oven one. And this one is our microwave one. And we have some peaches here. Which, um, I will eat a peach now. Mmm. Really good. Peach. Delicious. So... Well, I can tell just by looking at it that the microwave one, I mean the other one is um more browner than this one. As you can see, it's more burnt down here than this one. This one, by touch, I can also see that um, this one's uh, softer. This one is harder. This thing might be crispier. Well, I don't think there's much difference in smell. <laughs> Go ahead. No, this one smells more burnt. Um, and yeah. There's no different sound really. You can see them. I think this thick is. Yeah, this one's like different too. This one's more brown than this one. Well, we're just gonna you know, take a bite out of them. So let me just uh, put that up there. Hopefully, you guys can see me. Okay, let's uh, try this one first. It's the microwave one. Okay. Let's go to the kit. Mm. The bread is kind of chewy. Mm. 
This is a hot dog. Worth my. Now let's try this one. Mmm. It's more crunchier. It is more harder to rip off. They're good. This one's like soft. Yeah, the hot dogs are pretty much the same. This one's more hotter just because, you know, it just came out of the oven, but they're pretty much the same. They're really good. Mm, and if you look at it, the bread seems to be more to itself and is more sticky and squishy. This one doesn't stick to you really. It's toy. This bread is a little crunchy. Not chewy at all. So, yeah. Well, so to me. I think the other one is better than the microwave one. But I get if your parents are not home, you know. I know so this has been sitting out for a while. That's also why not the words going to and stuff like that. Why it's cold. And this one's so hot because it just came out of the oven, so yeah. But I just say that the oven one's better, so do the oven.